August 20th, Tuesday. The most urgent aspect for remnants. 2 Corinthians chapter 10, verse 4 and 5. The weapons we fight with are not the weapons of the world. On the contrary, they have divine power to demolish strongholds. We demolish arguments and every pretension that sets itself up against the knowledge of God. And we take captive every thought to make it obedient to Christ. The most urgent aspect for remnants are to build a proper partisan. Partisans that are made during the remnant years determine everything. Those who've killed a lot of people had the wrong partisans built when they were young. If remnants build God's partisans now, works will occur that'll make the force of darkness tremble. Then how should remnants create God's partisans within them? Number one, in the morning, God's partisan. In the morning, by praying with the seven partisans, seven journeys, and seven guideposts, remnants have to raise God's partisans. At first, they may seem like nothing, but later on they'll become something tremendous. Number two, in the afternoon, the spiritual summit. In the afternoon, remnants must say the prayer of the spiritual summit when they have to judge or choose. They should always choose the spiritual summit because they already possess the power to save the field. The seven remnants use this power to save the entire world. Through two lifelines, remnants must gain God-given infinite strength and enjoy the blessing of world evangelization. Number three, at night, masterpieces. At night, remnants have to create amazing masterpieces. Then over time, platform will be created. At this time, the watchtower will be created as well. As a result, people will come to see the light that shines from there. The most important aspect is to communicate with God. By doing so, the antenna that can communicate with people and all things will be created. Remnants must hold on to the word and pray and breathe to save their brains and bodies. This will create a breathing system so that power can appear. By continuing comfortably, remnants will be equipped with unseen knowledge and power. For remnants who possess these powers, they won't have any competitors on their paths. Simply put, they'll gain victory without fighting. Because all problems that occur to remnants are preparations for the future, there's no need to be discouraged or break down. Instead, through prayer, all they have to do is find God's greater plan. Covenantal Prayer Dear God, please help remnants restore the strength to truly receive answers. Help them become remnants who will lead and save the world, instead of being imprinted with the world and its standards. In Jesus Christ's name I pray. Amen.